You know, the police department's been cracking down on speeders since last February. And that's when their unmarked so-called stealth car began patrolling the streets. So how successful has the stealth car been? Chris 6 News reporter Jeremiah Marshall has an update. 48. If you tend to get a little lead foot while driving. Here's your driver's license and your ticket, okay? You okay? You may want to reconsider. The police department's stealth car is still on the prowl for speeders, and it has some backup. A second stealth car was added in March. Since then, they've been on the streets. The stealth units have both made over 1,600 stops and issued over 870 speeding citations. CCPD making a conscious effort when it comes to distractive driving and speeding. So these are all things you may want to consider before backing out of your parking spot. When people are driving faster or at a higher rate of speed, they don't just put themselves in, uh, in danger. They're putting everybody else who's on the roads in danger. Speeders aren't the only ones on the stealth unit's radar. Officers need the public to be aware that driving while distracted is also very dangerous. People who are driving are busy rubbernecking looking at the road rather than paying attention to driving. And we've had several officers that have been hit or injured because of that. And remember, if you do decide to speed, it just so happens that today they got caught. Officers will be watching. Jeremiah Marshall, Chris, 6 News. There goes that warning.